It was predicted 45 years ago, but it was only earlier this year that the existence of the Higgs boson could finally be proven. Today, Professor Higgs and Professor Anglais, two of the men behind the prediction, were invited to the European Parliament for the 25th anniversary of STOA, who give scientific advice to European policymakers. The discovery of this particle is potentially the beginning of another road, which is uh, to explore the, the physics of, of, of what lies beyond the standard model. Perhaps the machine will have to uh, run at much higher energies before the others are discovered, if indeed they, are, they, they exist. The boson discovered at the CERN laboratory near Geneva helps explain how particles acquire mass. Now the concern is that money won't be found for further research. Si no, no, no. Professor Anglais si said no, if we don't subsidise a long-term si financial no, commitment to take forward this fundamental research, we carry a real risk of doing nothing more than applied research, which is just a copy of what others are doing. Scientists now want to know what makes up the other 95% of the universe, composed of dark matter and dark energy. They hope that finding the bosom will give clues as to where to look. It took us 50 years to, to, to complete the five understanding of the 5% and now we have to go much further. So at the moment we have a clear program until around 2030 with this machine to explore whatever we can into the dark universe.